Yeah, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Cardi here. I want to welcome you guys to a new video. Today we're here to react to the NBA 2K20, the neighborhood trailer, as well as break it down after the initial reaction. But just to let you guys know, the goal for this video is 3,000 likes. Make sure you guys please hit that goal for your boy. Shout out to everybody who has been subscribing and turning on notifications. Big shout out to the Nodi gang. I know earlier you guys noticed that I uploaded, then deleted, then re-uploaded the um, actual initial trailer that I did. So shout out to all you guys who caught me especially on twitter and instagram but uh let's go ahead and hop into it um we're basically going to react to this trailer right here then we're going to break it down scene by scene see things that we miss if i miss anything please be sure to put it inside the comment section because sometimes i'll be so hype or so focused on one initial thing that i sometimes forget other things so let's go ahead and watch it by the way we will be watching without sound due to copyright reasons all right, so I guess we got the tree of life now. Um, okay, that tree's dead. Okay, it's August. Um, spring, maybe? Okay, so I'm guessing they hinted to different seasons um, so far. All right, they got the Wall of Fame somewhere totally different. All right, Core Conqueror is back. Got a little moat there. Uh, I'm not liking Park After Dark. No one likes cages. Can't stand a Gatorade facility. That backpack is dope. I would never in my life ride on a bicycle like that. Okay, will I be able to ride in a race car? Okay, it looks like a ton of park events. Big Top Challenge. I would never ride one of those. Gold Rush is back. Okay, we're playing Frisbee now. Big Top Challenges are with big heads. So, what's the point of NBA 2K Playgrounds? Okay, um, all right, Dodgeball is a thing in the Wild Wild West. Okay, my rep progression is huge. Okay, we'll definitely talk about that. Um, pro, was that Pro Am 3v3? Okay, um, I'm guessing that's Gold Rush and we have to find something. Okay, Basketball Gods, is that a new park event as well? Okay, Toxic Park, I don't know, Halloween is here, okay. Okay, it's the harvest, it's spring, all right, Christmas. Okay, winter, all right, that's, that's dope. Okay, so I'm guessing that parks will now be themed. Okay, okay, okay. So, off the initial reaction, off the rip, um... My reaction to the trailer is it seems like they're throwing in a ton of events to overshadow just a stale park in a sense. Maybe they'll have uh, events broken up weekly or bi-weekly to add a little bit more uh, finesse and freshness to the game. But I feel like it's a, it's a lot of event heaviness going on. Um, the My park progression system that I've seen was really, really good. Um, I want to actually break that down i want to i want to see what i can see but um let's just go ahead and start playing and pausing and things that we notice so um the first thing that i notice is this huge tree here so i'm guessing like this is the tree of life um this is going to be a tree that kind of dictates what time of the year it is um whether it is um thriving during the summer um if it's uh like fall time and the, the the leaves are dying different colors to winter time with no leaves and then springtime again when the leaves are starting to grow back maybe um what i noticed is they got the pro am over there in the back um they still have is that is that any up and daily spin over there all right that's cool let's let's, let's see what else we get okay oh hold up now hey that, that that picture cut real quick okay hold up all right same thing all right all right it says that the um pelican team facility so i'm guessing you're on the pelicans in this trailer all right fall back to spring okay that looks like is that the nba store that's the nba store will this be like your apartment like why do they have that little screenshot there are they showing off the birds are they are they trying to say that now they got like living like things animating throughout the park because of the birds is the bird supposed to be like a highlight to the trailer okay all right i get it i get it okay so the nba 2k19 wall of fame is somewhere different it's now in the back it's not up against the wall over near the pro-am stage anymore it's over near the gatorade facility now and now it's like a like literally a wall of fame oh, okay all right so i see pro-am playground in the back so I'm guessing as a pro-am team, you can now play. Okay, so if this is pro-am playground, do they still have the team creator? 
or will that pro-am team be the only creation that you need to make and then you guys can hit the playground with your pro-am team instead of like that created team thing because that was like two separate things it was like you created a team and you created a pro-am team but now it's your pro-am team everything i don't know i had that i had this uh this hoodie, but I had like cut off sleeves when 2K19 first started. Okay, hold up. Ooh, let me go back a little bit. All right, let's see, guys. Um, I think I seen something in that uh that screenshot. Let's see. Okay, hold up. Bike and skate shop. Okay, so the bike and skate shop got a redesign. It says Italian food center on the uh, other side. So maybe you get the. Does your player eat now, or is that just like? You know what I'm saying like they got a Domingos. I see the swag shop right there. All right. Also, like, what's up with this steam right here? Like, is this like a whole nother like you see the steam coming up from like is this a whole nother part? Like, I don't or is this an event that's going on? All right, so you got Court Conqueror with the little moat. Um, that looks really, really nice. Um, honestly, that's that's a nice little redesign. Um, I see swags right there. All right, hold, hold, hold up now. Hold up now. They're going too fast, man. These camera cuts going too fast. I need to break this down. All right, let me see. All right. Late night ramen. A diner. I see one my player standing over there. I mean, will you be able to, will your player actually, will you have to keep your player fit? Like, is this more of like role playing now? I don't know, is this, is this more of an RPG at the park or something? Because, like, they're showing a lot of, like, food spots. All right. Oh. I want to see Park After Dark. They got to stop cutting these, these these corners so fast, man. Jeez. All right. So, Park After Dark. All right. So, looking at this, guys. Park After Dark event has... Uh, more courts. Let me see. I'm just trying to look at like what the standard court would be for 2K. So this is full court, three spots, three spots here, three spots there. Look like three spots over there as well. But I want to know what the overhead look of the park is going to look like. Because I know sometimes they, they switch up the way that the park is going to look depending on that tunnel coming in though. That tunnel is fire. Can't lie about that. They got a little big screen over here. I'm guessing that'll be like challenges and stuff that are happening during um, Park After Dark, maybe. Cages. Nobody likes cages. I'm just going to move on from that. Gatorade facility. I'm not worried. The backpack. The backpack is dope. Um, Something says get yours now. Footlocker.com. So I'm guessing that's like maybe a shoe endorsement or something on that billboard. This. Nah. No. Heck no. I won't be riding this around. I'm not buying this for me and nobody else. And nobody better ask me to get on. But what I do notice is that they answered our prayers. We now look like we get to ride our bicycles and stuff on the actual park playground part. So that's cool. They still got the My Team store. Um, like I said, that little diner is over there. So I guess, I guess food and dining is like a little added incentive or something or... Hopefully you'll be able to interact with it. Like if, if, if it's just a diner, just randomly there taking up a spot and be a little upset. All right. Now that's, that's scary. Let me see. All right. So check that out. Like, do you guys see like the, the race car S type thing? Like I see that they got the wreck over there. It looks like they're not calling it, calling it Jordan wreck this year. Okay. Let's, let's keep going. All right. So right here I'm looking at the parks they got they got like a whole race car driver scene going around the whole park but i'm not sure if you'll be able to be in the driver like i don't know if you'll be able to be a driver okay formula 2k it must be an event okay so what what um what what race car company did 2k partner up with for this to happen so this this looks like a definite 2k event looks dope okay um two times the crunch hot wings ruffles is back okay so that i'm guessing that's hot wings chips all right so ruffles is back hitting from ruffle range okay 
All right, now as this player shot that, this is, this doesn't look like an event, does it? I see the barbershop is over there. It looks like it got a, a new design. Um, looking, the courts are definitely different. This one is transparent and this backboard is different. So maybe, maybe that is an event. Big Top Challenge with your mascots. Mascots confirmed, of course. But Big Top Challenge is something crazy because, ooh, let me see that. This is what I wanted to look at. Is this like Gold Rush? Does that mean like you get a Gold Rush skateboard or something? I don't know. I'm not liking these Under Armour shorts. I like this little wall art though. I'm I'm really not feeling this. Who else is not feeling the the uh, tricycle joints like from back in the day? Like it looks like it looks like it runs on a motor, but like because like you're not really uh, pedaling your feet. But who knows? All right, big top challenge. I noticed like they had a whole bunch of big heads out here. This is hilarious, but this this really right here would be a lot better for people with face scans. Like like I'm talking about people that actually got scanned in the 2K from 2K, not done doing it with your cell phone. I noticed that they have some over here called 2K shoes. Um, maybe that's like a little general store for like maybe just all 2K branded stuff. I'm not sure though. Um. I see you still get to play with your headphones on. A mascot inside of the Big Top Challenge won't get a big head. That looks that looks pretty confirmed. Um, this old Wild Wild West theme, like I'm guessing this is just for dodgeball in itself, maybe. I don't know, but like I'm looking at the backpack. I'm trying to figure out what that is. Oh, that looked like a dodgeball backpack. That's what it looks like. I don't know, but dude got plastered right there. This, this, what he about to do to him is about to be insane. Bow! Oh, God, Molly Watt. Now, this is the progression system that, um, that they showed us. Um, check this out. So, they have Rookie 1, Rookie 2, Rookie 3, Pro 1, 2, 3, All-Star 1, 2, 3, Superstar 1, 2, 3, and it's another tier after that. But, let's look at this. Um, prizes unlocked at All-Star 2. Uh, Screen Crusher. Blow up hard screens in the neighborhood. Okay, um... Customize my court floor, tier two player panels. But um, one thing that I see here is that they have elite three. So the my rep progression system from last year is actually giving us something this year. So last year, nobody really cared about being a rookie or pro all-star, none of that. But now that they have elites and you actually get something for it, I guess it just broke up the way that the, the system is. So it's no longer the road to 99 where you only get stuff in 99 i'm guessing now you get things as you progress so um i see that we got rookie brown shirt let's go ahead and um see what they have at the end okay so this this is moving pretty fast okay hold on hold on one second guys all right so unlock all right let's let's try to do this oh my god it's moving so fast Jeez, I would have to get like all the screenshots. All right, hold up. All right, so bling bling, head over to Swags. My court room's available. You get to wear accessories. Ooh, Legend jerseys available. Swags now um, has all the eyewear you want. So you get to wear eyewear at Pro 3, okay? You can go get a scooter. Ooh. Um, drop beats and perform them in the neighborhood. Okay, so you get at All Star Three, you get like a whole DJ stand, Tier Four emotes, a BMX bike. Ooh. Um. Okay. Uh, beats uh, available at Swags. Unlock the additional part gameplay animations. You get to spin it again at a Superstar Two. You get to spin the wheel twice. Ooh. All right. Um. Let me see. First crack on on all 2K shoes. Tier 5 emotes, no place like my court. What does that mean? Oh, hold up now. All right, so check this out. At, at Locked at Elite 3. At Elite 3, you will no longer be able to get a mascot at 98 overall. You get a mascot at Elite 3. So in order to have a mascot costume one, you have to be Elite 3 at the park. At Elite 3, you get to dress like an Elite. So you can come to the park in a suit. Um, Let's see go back a little bit you get to pick up a skateboard at pro one all right let me see 
I'm gonna come back and see if I can catch it. Start to ah. at Elite Two, okay. Um, something, something wheels. My style. You get to create your own T-shirt at an Elite Two. Double the VC, double the fun at uh, Elite Two. So you'll earn two times the VC for every game played at the park. That's really dope. I, I wish I could, like, man, if this was like a real breakdown video and I had like actual screenshots, it'd be crazy. But I, I didn't want to keep you guys too long, but it's a lot going on. That's a dope little upgrade. Um, This little Pro-Am thing here, I'm not really understanding what this means. Like, I feel like maybe Pro-Am is more so like, like I said, that create a team thing. All right, let's see. Go rushing all that, okay. This theme right here, this must be the 2K Gods theme because uh, it looked like I see it on his shirt or yeah, Basketball Gods. It looks like like a, a nice little uh, event there. Um, does this mean that we'll have fireworks on July 4th? Um, I don't know, is this like the Toxic Park uh, event or something? Like play, playing as toxic as possible? Does this mean like we'll have unlimited stamina and stuff like that if we play this this event or something like that to get toxic i don't i don't know like i don't know um halloween that looks like a whole uh event and stuff like that um spring coming in or fall depending on i, I believe this is more fall let's see okay christmas is really huge um you know snowman and everything like that out presents out that's really really dope this is this is a nice lit scene right here um, I really can't notice anything because mostly everything is blurred out except for, well, everything is blurred out, honestly. But yeah, so that's it. That's that's my breakdown. Um, I know that if I downloaded this trailer, of course, which I have already done, and I got actual screenshots like like uh, frame by frame, which I'll probably do. You guys can probably follow me on uh, Instagram or Twitter. I'll probably put out each of those um, probably later today. So make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Uh, also, the giveaway is still live. Um, if you check the description, I'm still giving away copies of NBA 2K20. Um, I want to thank everybody for watching this video. Thank you for watching the breakdown. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. Yeah. You can't watch this whole video without subscribing.